Let's uh, get back into the game. Yeah. Good. Yeah, I think. Uh, I think so. So what are you doing? Right now, I'm trying to prep this rocket for flight on a research motor. Uh, and NASA M2000 blue propellant, nice fast propellant. Um, had to do some typical engine, last minute engineering for a motor retention system. Right well, I know about the motor retention, but why isn't the payload done ready to go? Uh, because people like Bob Utley uh, come over and talk to me. And <laughs> the first time I have other things. That you should have had this done when you came out. You should have just been able to put the two halves well, together and stick it on the pad. True. You know? But you know, sometimes life isn't fair to us, and, <laughs> and you have to put up with the adversity that, I guess. that you create for yourself. <laughs> See, I don't have those problems. I don't have such a responsible life. <laughs> well, it still looks like this stuff's been. It probably has it's stuck in there for years. <laughs> well, it may, it may not have necessarily left. The I, rocket I'm looking since at this, was, you know. I know it may not have actually left the rocket since it was packed in there last year, <laughs> after last year's flight. So obviously, we'll have to take this all apart and uh, you gotta wash it and dry clean and all that. Well, stuff. I don't know if we're gonna get that fanatical, but uh, <laughs> I left the iron back at Bruno's. Did so you? Gonna iron it, yeah. So. Yeah, it looks good. Okay, well. Keep our fingers crossed. I think it's looking pretty good. Straight you might have it done. You got two more days. You think that's enough time for you to get everything prepped? It might be. All right. I hear the winds are going to get pretty bad tomorrow afternoon, so fly it by tomorrow morning or forget it, I think is. Uh, I think that's just an old wives' tale. Could be. <laughs> yep. All right, I'll let you get back at it. Okay, ball. Well.